let's check this. Boom, we're good to go, here we go. What is up guys and welcome back to the John Key channel. Thanks so much for watching today's video. I'm, I'm very excited about today's video. I'm going to break down how I gained almost 20,000 followers in about 24 to 48 hours. So let's get into it. You've heard me talk about TikTok. If you follow me on Instagram, Facebook, the YouTubes, the Twitch, the Twitter, the Snap, all the mediums, right? You've heard me talk about how TikTok can turn you into this huge business brand, like this huge model on the social media platform. It's what's been working for me. And so if you know me, I'm just a grinder. I love to get the work done. And now I'm gonna show you how I got those videos done. To give you some background, to give you some proof, here's a screenshot that I took on Friday at 6.39 p.m. I had 45,000 followers and 1.4 million likes. Fast forward to today, 10.42 a.m., I have 61,000 followers. That, that's literally 15,000 followers plus in a matter of days, guys. And so I'm gonna break down how I did this. There's really no special method. I didn't growth hack myself. I didn't pay someone to get me more followers. This growth only has to do with the content that I put out as Johnny Q and no one else. The fact that I know how to navigate and maneuver my own content on TikTok to essentially blow up. Let's, let's explain viral videos just for one second. Viral videos, a lot of people think it's, oh, millions and millions of views, that creates a viral video. Although that is correct. A viral video can also be hundreds of thousands of views in a matter of hours or days. It's something that blows up in a short amount of time. Again, I wasn't planning for it. I wasn't trying to get out there and make viral videos. It just happened. This is that video right here. I think my next door neighbor is doing a TikTok and I have to be friends with her. This has to happen. She's doing a TikTok. Hey, are you doing a TikTok? So there she said yes, but I cut it too early because I was only filming in 15 second mode and not 60 second mode. I'm on TikTok too. And that's where I ended it. Even though she came over here, came to my house and was like, yo, give me your TikTok uh, ad, let's follow each other, let's get on TikTok. That's what happened after the fact. I didn't film that because I knew right then and there, I knew I caught people's attention right by zooming up on my neighbor and saying, hey, I think my neighbor is doing a TikTok. That automatically engages you and brings you into what's happening. There's something going on and I have to see what's happening. I think my next door neighbor is doing a TikTok and I have to be friends with her. And so automatically in those first four to five seconds, I have gripped you. I have told the audience what's going on. And so it just leaves the consumer, the audience, the person more time on that video. And the way TikTok works is you want your consumer, your audience to be on your channel, on your videos as long as possible and watch that video to completion from start zero to 30 seconds, 40 seconds, 15 seconds. In this case, I had to capture the moment and I had to capture the virality of this moment. I knew in my heart, I knew in my soul that it was just something was gonna happen just because of how I already laid this out. I didn't go outside, I, was, I stayed indoors and I filmed this piece, right? And so I didn't show you the rest because I knew there was something there and people would question and people would want to see more. And so uh, remember when I said from start zero to the end of the video, that is what I did and so I got people to complete the entire video, probably watched it more than once, so you have to rewatch it and be like, okay, turn this up because I need to know what's going on in this video. That's just some of the, the techniques. It's not even a technique, it's more so that I know how to videotape something, how to film something in a way where it grabs your eyes. And, and I think that's the majority of what TikTok can be. Have a viral video, you have to have all those components of, if it, is it interesting? Does it lure your audience in? Is it going to complete you know, your full video length in watch time? Are people going to see the entire video? Do you have something interesting to say or are you capturing something in the moment? And so I've gotten videos with millions of views. I've gotten videos with hundreds of thousands of views, likes and comments. And so that, just, that works for me because I know how to comprehensively storytell in a positive way that brings you, the audience, the consumer into my content. And so that's just how I create viral videos, I guess you can say. Uh, it's just capturing the moment and going from there. It's pretty easy, you just, you just gotta do it. <laughs> I think I'm gonna make more of these videos because I like them and I think that you guys will find this valuable as well. So let me know down below in the comments if uh, you wanna see more videos like the TikTok video, how I create mine, how to create viral videos, how to do different things in the media, photo and video. Let me know down below, would love to know. 
And with that being said, guys, thanks so much for watching. I appreciate you watching. It really means the world to me, guys, and I'll catch you next time on the John Nee Q channel. Peace. I feel like we should do like a little jingle to John Nee Q channel. I'm gonna work on that. All right, peace out, guys.